favorite friends who are going to be drawing a freaking same burrito. Yeah, we hope you're going to follow along. It's going to be a lot of fun. You need your drawing supplies. We're going to use markers. Also, you need some paper and something to color with. Yeah, you ready to start? Yes. Let's first start by drawing our burrito, and we're going to draw it really big, filling up our paper. So we're going to start on the left side, top left, and we're going to draw a line that comes down, and then we're going to turn it into a big letter U. I'm going to come back up to the other side. <laughs> yes! Oh, it's really wide. I. If I do this all over again, I'm going to make it as wide as yours. <laughs> okay, now let's draw the, the rest of the wrap coming down. So we're going to draw it curving like this down and then connect to the left side. And then we're going to draw this part of the wrap coming down and connecting here. Yes, okay, now that's the wrap for a burrito. But let's change the filling or the stuff inside our burrito to be gross. We're going to draw a brain first, Frankenstein's brain. We're going to draw a bumpy line, and some of the bumps can be small and some big, but we're going to draw it coming all the way over to the other side. And then we can draw the squiggly lines inside of our brain. I'm going to draw little squiggles everywhere, and you can... You don't have to draw them exactly like me. You can change the squiggles any way you want. I'm going to draw lots of these little... Yeah, that looks like brain. Gross. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now let's add tomatoes. We're going <laughs> we're to draw little squares or V-shapes coming around the top of the brain. Yes. That looks better. <laughs> tomatoes with the brain. <laughs> yeah. Tomatoes are gross and brains gross too. Tomatoes are good. Well, yeah, I like. I, I do like tomatoes, not by themselves. <laughs> they got to be inside of a burrito. Okay, now let's add worms. <laughs> worms. <laughs> and we're gonna draw a curve that comes out to the left, and then we'll draw the end of the worm, and then we'll come back into the burrito. And I'm gonna draw another worm over here too, and maybe this worm kind of wiggles a little bit differently. And then I'm going to curve around and come back into the burrito. Let's, this one's long. <laughs> yeah, it's really long. He's trying to ex escape. <laughs> I'm going to draw curved lines for the texture on the worm and curved lines over here, too. <laughs> That's really gross. You could add even more gross things, like more worms or spiders or lettuce. <laughs> Let, let's draw more. Let's draw one more. Detail for the filling. I'm going to draw a wiggly line for the lettuce coming all the way over to the other side and behind the worms. Oh, we could add, I'm going to add sour cream. Maybe uh, another wiggly line inside for sour cream. That's gross too. Now let's draw the funny face for our Frankenstein. I'm going to draw a straight line right here. Then I'm going to come down like this. Curve around, over to the other side, and back up. And then we can draw the teeth inside. I'm going to draw round or even square teeth. You can even make some of them crooked and different sizes over to the other side. And then let's repeat that same step, but upside down for the teeth on the bottom of the mouth. And if we ever go too fast, what can our art friends do? Pause the video. Yeah, if you need extra time. You could even pause the video if you want to change your drawing and add more things. Yes, good job. Now let's add the tongue. I'm going to draw a curve that comes up, down, and then another one that comes around and connects down too. Now let's draw the eyes. I'm going to draw a circle over here and a circle over here for each eye. And we could also draw smaller circles inside to make the eyes look shiny. Let's color in the big circle, but leave the little circle white. It's scary. <laughs> now let's draw the wrinkle underneath our Frankenstein's eyes on both sides. Oh, we could also draw eyebrows. I'm going to draw a line that comes straight across the top of each eye. And then we can curve around for the top of the eyebrow and down. I'm going to do the same thing over here. Curve around and down. 
<laughs> Let's add more wrinkles on top of each eyebrow. <laughs> then we could also add stitch lines right here on the wrap. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> What's our Frankenstein missing? The bolts. Yeah, right down here, holding the head or the, I don't know, tortilla together. <laughs> I'm gonna draw uh, two short lines that come out. I'll do that a little slower on this side. So two short lines that come out, and then we'll draw a longer line that connects them. So we got that on both sides. Then let's draw two short lines coming out here. We can do that on this side too, to match. And then we'll connect the top down to the bottom. Oh, we could also draw a spider. Let's draw the web coming down and then a circle at the bottom. And then let's color in that circle. We could also draw a little head, a small circle at the bottom and color that in. And then let's draw the little legs sticking out. Oh, we gotta draw four, right? For each side. So we have eight legs. Jack, we did it. We finished drawing our Frankenstein burrito, except we're not completely done. We still need to color it. Yeah, my favorite part. We're gonna fast forward the video, so remember to pause the video and take extra time to color in your drawings. You ready to fast forward? Yes. Jack, we did it. We finished drawing and coloring our Frankenstein burritos. It's a pretty cool combo. Although I wouldn't want to eat this. Yeah, definitely not. <laughs> you can pause the video right now to match our same coloring. We used our markers to color with, but you can use whatever you have at home or in the classroom. You could use crayons or even colored pencils. Yeah. We hope you had fun drawing a Frankenstein burrito. We do. We hope you had a lot of fun and we hope you take time to color and add more things to your drawing. And we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.